I hope I am pronouncing this name right, but Jaham Najafi, the second largest Sun stakeholder, has publicly called for the resignation of Robert Sarver in an open letter to Phoenix Suns fans. You guys, this is a huge step in the right direction. Now, I'm not going to read you guys the entire statement because you guys are much better readers than I am, but I'm going to do my best to read you guys this last part. And this last part, in my opinion, is the most important part, and this is exactly how the NBA should have responded. This is what the final part of the statement says, and I quote, I cannot in good judgment sit back and allow our children and future generations of fans think that this behavior is tolerated because of wealth and privilege. Therefore, in accordance with my commitment to helping eradicate any form of racism, sexism, and bias, as vice chairman of the Phoenix Suns, I am calling for the resignation of Robert Sarver. Let me repeat that last part. As vice chairman of the Phoenix Suns, I am calling for the resignation of Robert Sarver. While I have no interest in becoming the managing partner, I will work tirelessly to ensure the next team's steward treats all stakeholders with dignity, professionalism, and respect. Amen a million times. This is exactly how the NBA and Adam Silver should have responded. And you guys, it's not just that. The city of Phoenix and the mayor is investigating Robert Sarver, well, the Robert Sarver situation, to see if they need to take any action. You guys, I'm not going to read you the entire statement again, but I will read you the last part. It says, and I quote, we have asked city staff to investigate any actions we as leaders of the city of Phoenix can take in light on the details sustained in the report. The actions as outlined in this report do not represent the values of this city. Amen. We call on the NBA to take actions required to ensure this behavior is stopped and to reform the culture that allowed these actions to occur, close quote. Also, you guys, if you missed it because I added it in last minute of my video as I was like uploading that video and editing and everything, Chris Paul tweeted out his thoughts, which you guys are reading on the screen right now. And you guys, this just continues to prove the point that the NBA got the decision wrong on the Robert Sarver suspension and that the NBA and Adam Silver need to do something that the Phoenix Suns owners and everything, they need to vote him out. The fact that our vice chairman is calling for his resignation and the fact that the city of Phoenix is potentially getting involved should be enough to force Robert Sarver out. But unfortunately, there's some people out there and Adam Silver and the NBA that think differently, which is honestly sad. So I want to know your guys' thoughts, comments, and opinions down below. Do me a huge favor, you guys, and Hulk smash that like button. Share this video because it really does help support the channel. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.